Jacob Truba. As a Penguins fan, a guy I'm supposed to hate. And trust me, when they play each other, I do. But boy, do I respect him. He is literally a freaking tree on skates. And yesterday, as we saw the clashing of two old rivals with the Rangers and the Flyers in Philly, it played out like you'd maybe expect. Just good, hard hockey. And Truba played his game. So let's get into it. The Rangers got off to a blazing start. On the rush, Wheeler to Zibanejad, and he opens the scoring. A great pass from Wheeler here, who with the right hand is able to wait a little longer than normal to make this pass and find Zibanejad. And yeah, just like that, it's one to nothing. And just a minute later, off the faceoff, and Kreider, with a great play to intercept the pass, scores and makes it two goals in just a minute and eight seconds. Definitely not the way the Flyers drew up the start they wanted to have, and so they needed to to respond and inject some energy. So who do you target? Jacob Truba, of course. Hathaway trying to lay a hit on Truba ends up in friendly fire as he would catch Delorier instead. But refusing to let him go, this hilarious sequence would unfold. But we have to take a closer look. Hathaway trying desperately to bait Truba into something as Delorier trying to hit Schneider comes flying into the scene and it's a pinball machine of big boys on skates. From there, Delorier all the way up the ice trying to get Truba to drop him and he's like, nah, nope, doesn't give him the time of day whatsoever. Continuing to play his game, even with a guy on him, would lay a huge hit on guess who? Hathaway. Kind of what he was asking for earlier as Truba talks a little smack. And finally, not Truba, but Goudreau obliges and would drop the gloves. Just a great sequence overall here that had me cracking up as Truba. Love him or hate him, you gotta admit he makes an impact on the ice. Now from there, as the period unfolded, the Flyers just couldn't solve Shesterkin, which gets us over to later in the period. Hathaway this time with a big hit on Lindgren and the mitts come off a second time as him and Cooley going at it Again, just a fun game here. Now, despite the Flyers out shooting the Rangers pretty heavily for much of the period, they couldn't ignite the power play and the Rangers would come out of the frame with a two goal lead. Over to the second now, and they would add to that. Wheeler again over to Mika Zabanajad again, going hard to the net, pretty redirect, and he'd have his second of the night to make this a three goal lead. Finally, though, the Flyers late in the second, Sealer from way out, and they score. Finally, breaking Shesterkin, it's Couturier on the doorstep step with his fifth to get the Flyers to within two. That then would get us over to the third and final period where again the Flyers just couldn't break Shesterkin. Some great chances really on both ends as Kreider in all alone and he appeared to score but this one was called back for offside. Regardless though the Rangers would hold on to take the dub as they are now 8-0-1 in their last nine against Philly and advance to 14-3-1 on the season. So a fantastic start to the season for them but that's it for this one. As always thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it very much and I will see you in the next one.